All right, welcome back to Pharmacist On Call, your one hour forum. Your doctors are busy, your pharmacists are busy. They don't have time. This hour, I do. So call in with those questions and those comments. Uh, we just wanted to uh, kind of let the public know about the TSU 5K for Legends Weekend. It's a 5K run at Tennessee State University at the track field that will be this Saturday. The, we will be out there as the water sponsor, the Congan Water Store of Nashville. Uh, so we'll be handing out water, uh, actually free water out there uh, to the runners. Uh, so just wanted to let you know about that. Also, I will be doing several speaking engagements for the month of April. So April 11th, it looks like we will be at the Hadley Park Towers. For those of you who are residents, I will see you on the 11th, Hadley Park Towers. On April 12th, Edge Hill. We will see you there for the community health fair at the, I believe it's the Garnet Homes, uh, Garnet Apartments, so we will be out there. And there will be all the following week on the 19th for uh, the uh, Edge Hill Edge Hill Apartments, I believe, is where or the Edge Hill High Rise. Uh, so that'll be on the 19th. And then on the 17th, we'll be at the Edgefield Manor on Shelby Avenue in East Nashville. So I'll be out there to speak with you, kind of let you know who we are, let you know about the water, which I'm getting ready to discuss a little further, uh, the beet juice, and some of the other things that you can do to help take better care of yourself. Uh, so to the caller, for those of you who are new and you didn't understand what type of water he was talking about, uh, the second business within the facility is the Kangen Water Store of Nashville. The word Kangen is Japanese for return to origins. So this water is what Adam and Eve drank. This is what water is supposed to be. It's supposed to be pollutant free. It is supposed to be alkaline and not have all the other stuff in it. So the, the basis is, is if you alkalinize water, you intake it, you begin to alkalinize the body. What is the benefit uh, to alkalinizing the body? Well, we have certain diseases that are caused by acidic diets, acidic drinks such as sodas, fruit juices, dairy products and the like. These things can manifest themselves as gout, uh, as arthritis, as acid reflux, as any number of different conditions. So what this water does, is once that alkaline water comes in contact with the hydrochloric acid in your stomach that's been giving you acid reflux, it neutralizes it. And most people that say that they have had the alkaline water, the acid reflux is gone in a very short time, probably less than an hour. So for those of you who are having to take Prilosec, whose generic is omeprazole, and having to wait two weeks for it to kick in, this water will take care of your acid reflux the same day and it will be nowhere near the cost of an omeprazole and it also won't damage your kidneys long term like the, uh, the omeprazole family will, the uh, proton pump inhibitors. Uh, the other piece is, is that once that alkaline water comes in contact with the uric acid in your joints, uh, produced by meats and the you know, purines and all of those different things and the tomato products and all the good stuff, the lasagna, the pizza, the spaghetti, all of that uric acid that's created, it neutralizes that acid. And so your gout can be gone in a day or less. So there won't be any need to take colchicine, which will hurt your stomach after you take so many uh, per day. So many people have benefited uh, from it. So any number of conditions, uh, I'm hearing diabetes from our patients, the cholesterols have gone down, uh, people have said, I mean, things that we didn't even expect, like menopause, depression, brain fog. One lady even came in and said that it uh, helped her doctor reduce her prescription eye drops because her vision is improving. So we're still kind of learning what all this water does, but hey, this show is about you and we've got you on line one. Lucy, welcome to Farm System Call. How may we help you? Yeah, hey Doc, how you doing? Pretty good, ma'am. How are you? I am fine, thank you. You just mentioned the, the water and how it neutralized your stomach acid. For instance, for people who are like on Prilosec. Yes, ma'am. And uh, I don't think a lot of people realize that Prilosec has some pretty serious side effects. And I didn't know that one of them was suicidal tendencies. Yes, ma'am. Because the doctor told me that it really doesn't like drop in your stomach and neutralize the acid. It works on your brain and shuts down your digestive system from your mouth to your rectum. Is that not true? Uh, well, actually, <laughs> I'm not sure. I'm not, <laughs> I mean, really? I can't really verify that. No, it's a proton pump inhibitor. So it inhibits the, uh, the flow of uh, hydrogen ions into the gut to create hydrochloric acid. So it, it's how would it do that? Up in your brain? Uh, I would, well, there, I'm sure that there is a brain component to it, but... Well, I, I 
went and researched and looked up and read some of that stuff that you get, you know, from, I guess, the PDR or whatever. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Goes into detail. Yes, ma'am. And it was right there. It said suicidal thoughts because it works on the brain. It shuts down the brain. Yeah, yeah. So then it probably has an effect on some of the neurotransmitters in the brain as well. So it, it, that's why it was. you have to be careful how much you take of it or whatnot. Mm. But So that would be a better choice, that water. than. And I'm not trying to, you know, diss Prilosec or anything. But I am. Your better choice would be the water then, wouldn't it? It to Absolutely. Straight out, quickly neutralize that acid. It never worked for me. Oh yeah, you're gonna say. And the issue with though the proton pump inhibitors is that it takes you taking it for about 14 days before you feel the effect. So you don't want to wait that long when your stomach is on fire. Why not drink the water, neutralize it, and also get other health benefits as well, and not risk your kidneys or suicidal ideation. Yeah, I took it for six weeks. Never helped once. Yeah, yeah. So. Okay, Doc. Well, thank you. All right. Appreciate your call, ma'am. Bye-bye. All right. Thank you. All right. Sherry, line two. Welcome to Pharmacist On Call. How may we help you? Yes. Hi. Um, I have a quick question. I've been taking paroxetine, 20 milligrams, um, antidepressant for yes, years. And recently, I've kind of stumbled upon a roadblock. With getting in with my physician, I've ran out of uh, my medicine, and okay. I've been off of it now for about six days. I've tried to call my doctor, and they won't prescribe me anything until I come in, and even for just a few days. And so I'm off of it cold turkey, and I'm having some really bad um, symptoms. Mm-hmm. And so I'm thinking about just going off of it because I've had this ongoing problem with my doctor, and it's really affecting me, like my safety. Okay. Um, and I just want to see if I can go to something herbalistic or or should I seek another doctor who won't do this to me as a patient? Well, uh, well, two things. Yes, you can go herbal, but hey, let's let's see what's going on with our doctor. So is it that you don't feel comfortable with, with this physician and you don't want to see no, them anymore? No, the doctor's wonderful. It's just they said something about new state laws. I haven't gone into senior since August. Uh-huh. And uh, my pharmacy, Kroger's, was kind enough to give me three days' worth, and it okay. took them about six days to call me back and tell me that they have got the script from the pharmacy to refill. Okay. But apparently my refill ran out in March, and um, they wouldn't do it. And I was like, well, can I at least have a couple of pills so I can get there for my appointment because I'm working eight days straight? And they were like, no, we can't do that. So um, I'm feeling really, really weird as far as, like, my driving skills are kind of off because my... I can't differentiate between distance, and when I when I'm at work, I feel like I'm I am stumbling into things, and my my talking is off. And my manager was really concerned. She's like, you know, I can tell even your voice is really shaky. She goes, Sherry, you can go into a seizure without this medicine cold turkey. Yes, ma'am. And yeah, I need so. to I need to know if there's something herbalistic that I can just you know do myself without having to go through this as a patient for again because this is horrible. <laughs> Okay, yeah, we're going to talk about that. Why can't you get to the doctor? Um, I was going to make an appointment with him while I'm working. I work. Oh, okay, uh, so you said eight days or something? Yeah. Okay, all right. So, yeah, you can... I can't get to her. I'd have to take time off work, but they wouldn't prescribe anything until then. Yeah, so they, I guess, uh, either A, want their office copay, or B, they want to evaluate you to see if they want to adjust your dose. Yeah. Uh, but if either is the case... Um, the neurotransmitter that is affected by the uh, the class of drugs that you're taking, so you're taking paroxetine, which is like fluoxetine and Cymbalta for those of you, affects the serotonin uh, reuptake. So you want something to stimulate increased serotonin in the brain, which is your feel-good neurotransmitter. Uh, so things that come to mind is 5-HTP. Uh, you can take it directly. And I believe DLPA, which is DL phenylalanine. But I will probably start out with 5 HTP first. Okay, let me write that down. Or is sure. there someone I can talk to after I get off the phone with you and write this down? Sure, yeah. I think it's, oh, yes, ma'am. I think it's 5 hydroxytryptophan is what the, oh, the chemical wonderful, name is. Oh, wonderful, wonderful. Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, I, th- I thank you for it very much. And if I can um, maybe speak with someone after I get off the phone with you and write this down. Yes, ma'am. Yeah, actually, you can uh, give me a call tomorrow. Uh, she's going to flash the information at the store. Uh, so I'll be there at 9 a.m. Uh, all day. So just, you know, either give me a call. Well, there it is right there. Uh, so give us a call or you can just pop in and, uh, you know, it's open door policy. So people come in all the time off the street. So. Okay. Mm-hmm. 
Well, thank you very much. Yes, ma'am. You're welcome. All right. All right. Thank you. Uh huh. All righty. All right, so uh, yeah, so for those of you who are having issues with um, your antidepressants and you're kind of wanting a natural option, 5-HTP, 5-hydroxytryptophan, or uh, DL-phenylalanine. I believe DL-phenylalanine uh, affects the, uh, the reuptake of serotonin as well. I've double-checked myself. Uh, but we've got another caller. Pat, I ain't one. Welcome to Pharmacist on Call. How may we help you? Yes, I took uh, Pantoxol, and I heard you talking about Prilosec had a lot of sad effects. And I take Pantoprazole for uh, acid reflux. So yes, ma'am. Does it have a lot of bad side effects that I'm not aware of? It is the, I believe it's a class effect for all proton pump inhibitors. Okay. Yes, ma'am. So you're probably going to have this issue. Well, not everybody gets it, but there is a certain percent of the population that gets these side effects. Okay, so you would, I heard, I just came in on kind of the tail end of it a while ago, but I heard you talking about the alkaline water. Yes, ma'am. Hey. Would help? Uh, yes, ma'am. So, I mean, we have people that even work at the pharmacy. Cause everybody comes there, they don't believe it. So they have to see for themselves. Yeah, but once you drink that water, it neutralizes that acid pretty quickly in your stomach. So we have people, the people that buy it call it crack water. And that's because you feel super on this water, but the minute that you, you stop drinking it, all those symptoms come back rather quickly and you're forced to come running back in. Uh, for those of you who have seen people going in and out of the store with all those jugs. But yes, that water would be much better for you than your prescription medicine. You don't run the risk, like I said, of suicidal ideation, uh, of all the other issues. You don't have to wait the 14 days for it to start to work. And then certainly the long-term effect on the kidneys uh, that the drugs have as well. So I'm diabetic, so if I take the alkaline, it's not going to affect my diabetic condition either. I'm sorry, I'm afraid it is, ma'am. It is going to make your blood sugar better. Oh. It is going to lower your A1C. It is going to lower your fasting blood sugar. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, I appreciate it. Thank you so much. All right. Yes, ma'am. You're welcome. All right, everyone. We are up on a break. Stay right there. We'll be right back. <laughs> 